newly unveiled solar fields near Comanche and East Panama Lane are expected to provide enough energy to power more than 25,000 houses per year, not to mention improve our air quality. 23 ABC's Kelly Johnson is live tonight to tell us more about it. Kelly? Good evening. You wouldn't believe the size of this solar power plant. It's about 660 acres, which is approximate to about 505 football fields. Now, this makes it Sun Edison's largest in all of North America. And today, we were there as they unveiled the Regulus Solar Project. This was a huge success for Sun Edison and for Bakersfield. Today marked a home run for all involved with the Regulus Solar Project. We produced a, a lot of local jobs. Uh, at peak employment, we had about 530 people out here every day. It's the largest project we've built to date in North America, and we couldn't have done it without the help of the community, the support of the, the landowners, the county. It's it's a tremendous achievement and we're really proud to be here today to celebrate the grand opening. A project that took over four years of planning, roughly one year to build, and the plant size measures to an equivalent of over 500 football fields. We have 248,000 individual Sun Edison produced panels here. That number of panels greatly aids in reducing the amount of carbon dioxide in the air, equivalent to not burning 125 million pounds of coal a year. It's also enough to power 10,000 homes per year. That's enough to provide power to the city of Taft for over 20 years. This is uh, part of our goal of operating clean, renewable energy facilities. It also took $125 million to finance the Regulus project. The financing came from one of Silicon Valley's most notorious companies by the name of Google. We've been very focused on um, investing in projects that make sense financially, but also those that allow um, the energy grid to diversify the sources of uh, electricity. This could just be the beginning. When asked what's next for Sun Edison, they responded by telling us that. We're just going to keep this going, hopefully for 20, 30, 40 years, uh, keep producing clean energy for the area. Uh, we have a couple more projects uh, we're building in the Central Valley, and we've also been growing our, our domestic business, global business. You know, we you know, hope to do more and more. And that's good news. With more power plants will come more jobs for Kern County. I'm Kelly Johnson reporting for 23 ABC. Back to you, Jackie and Tim.